Hello all my buttercups, this is Chris Stafford with Massive Abundance. And listen, I've got this great topic that I really want to talk about today because I just had a real estate agent call me on the phone, somebody that I'm doing some consulting work with, and uh, she said to me, you know, this escrow is never going to work. This escrow is because the buyers aren't working together, the sellers aren't working together, and you know, the, the other agent is not working together well. And it's just like, this is never going to work. And I thought to myself, hmm, somebody needs a little dose of the secret sauce of massive abundance. <laughs> Listen, the secret sauce, one of the secret sauces with massive abundance, are you ready for this? It's optimism. I know I hate to say use that word, but optimism is something that is really so important. You know, if you go through the seven steps of massive abundance and relate that, relate that to your business, you're going to find that optimism is going to be one of the key components that's actually step five because it's so important that you, as a realtor and as a real estate broker or any entrepreneur for that matter, have a sense of built-in optimism. Now, I'm not talking about some crazy ass you know, Pollyanna, you know, head in the sky kind of stuff where, you know, you're just, you know, blatantly, you know, just uh, delusional, <laughs> in other words. But listen, if you want to be a badass realtor, you have got to understand the importance of optimism in your business. They even did a research study on this. Barbara Fredrickson of the University of North Carolina literally did a study which said that three, you have to have three positive thoughts out of what, for every negative thought that you have. And that's a success barometer for all successful entrepreneurs. And you have to have a minimum of three positive thoughts to one negative thought. And they, she says that pretty much people that have more than 11 are delusional because they're always head in the sky, you know, everything is always, you know, rose colored glasses and all that kind of good stuff. But you have to have those three positive thoughts, five positive thoughts, whatever it takes. And you know, if you're not a positive person by, by nature, you can learn how to be optimistic. Yes, that is correct. And one a simple strategy is just to really find yourself being really negative in any particular situation and talk back to it. Recognize it, number one, and talk back to it, debate it. Why are you being so negative? Just the recognition of the thought and also then having a conversation with it, you can start changing the paradigm a little bit and start having those optimistic thoughts and they'll sort of become knee-jerk after a while. Yeah, you don't want to be Pollyanna. You don't want to have rose-colored glasses and just, you know, happy, happy, happy all the time. But it is really important in business, especially your real estate business, to put your positive hat on, become the optimist that you know you need to be, because if you're gonna be like all the other successful entrepreneurs out there, all the other successful real estate brokers, you are gonna to have to get your optimism on. <laughs> this is Chris Stafford with Massive Abundance, and may Massive Abundance be yours. Oh. How did you like that? Did you like, do you believe I used the word badass? Oh. I know, it's probably gonna turn some people off, oh well. I was sort of getting into it, man. <laughs>